Welcome back to the Sandbox. Thank you so much for coming by to play with me today. We're going to continue now here in Camp Buddy. We've just won the Camp Buddy Olympiad against Tyga's team. And it's time to call in our bet. What are we going to make Tyga do? Tyga, I want you to just apologize for all the bad things that you've said and done to everyone. I want us to start over. I want to be friends with you. Tyga's at a loss for words. Tyga, maybe this is a good idea. Indeed. We wouldn't have to feel like outcasts anymore. Huh. Fine. I'm sorry. But let me tell you this. You just wasted your breath and your bet. I'll never be friends with you. I'm going to make sure that I don't lose to you ever again. Tyga, wait for us. <sighs> Tyga. Are you all right, Katero? Don't worry. I, I'm okay. I really don't get what Tyga's deal is. That guy really is just stubborn as hell. Yeah, he was so mean to me and Sito too. It would have been so much more satisfying if we'd made fun of him instead. You could have at least let me give him the punch I offered, huh? The little twerp had it coming. Guys, please don't forget what Katero said. We did the right thing not getting back at Taiga. We showed that we're capable of being the better people here. That's right, Hunter. Thank you. We shouldn't let this bring us down. We did our best so that we could show what Camp Buddy is all about. Even Taiga's group worked harder as a team. I'm sure it's more than enough to prove to Sir Goro that Scoutmaster Yoshi taught us well. Y yeah, when I saw everyone giving their best, I couldn't help but do the same. I know that Taiga is acting unreasonable right now, but I'm sure that we'll understand him one day. Kato, you're just so positive all the time, buddy. In any case... I'm so glad to hear this from you guys. It's great that we all want to try and start over. Well, it's because of you, Katero. If it weren't for you, we wouldn't even consider giving him a second chance. Yeah, it's amazing how mature you are handling things like this. I am so thankful having a friend like you, Katero. Ah! Enough of this cheesy stuff already, all right? Well, looky here. The Scoutmasters have been observing how your two teams work together, and I can definitely say that they were really impressed. You can all sit down and relax and watch the rest of the sports fest for now. It's the other campers' turn to compete. All right, call in cabin two. Get into your positions. And so the program continued with the other teams competing against each other with enthusiasm and sportsmanship. Everyone was cheering and having fun with the special activity that Scoutmaster Yoshi prepared. It's easy to say that the Camp Buddy Sports Fest went better than I could ever ever have expected. May I have everyone's attention, please? This has been a spectacular day for all of us. As your Scoutmaster, I couldn't be prouder of each and every one of you for exhibiting teamwork and sportsmanship. This special activity would not have been possible without all of your cooperation. Before we officially conclude this event, we've got to clean up the obstacle course together. I'm sure that's fine with all of you, right? 
Yuri, they're all exhausted. It's okay, Yoshi. You've done more than enough. Let the campers help you with the rest, at least. I understand. Thank you, Yuri. Ah, don't worry, though. I'll make sure to cook something extra special tonight for all of ya. I'm sure you guys are going to be super hungry after all that cleaning, not to mention all the running and jumping all day. <laughs> all right, everyone. Get your cleaning equipment and let's tidy this place up. Well, it looks like the Scoutmasters are pleased with today's activity. Ha! Huh, your plan really worked out well, Katero. I bet that old man's going to change his mind about closing this camp. Thank you again, everyone. I hope what we did was enough for Sir Goro to consider his decision. It won't help thinking about it too much. What's important is that we did what we could. That's right, Hunter. Anyway, the day isn't over just yet. We need to help the Scoutmasters clean up. Yoichi, Hunter, could you help me with the cleaning equipment? What if I say no? Come on, Yoichi. You know you're the only one strong enough to carry all those buckets. You think I'd fall for that? No way I'm doing your chores for you. Go get them yourselves, all right? Give it up, Natsumi. We should know by now that Wolf Boy here never does any chores. I'll come help you guys out instead. Uh... Thank you, Hiro. You should get changed as well, Natsumi. You're still soaked from your race. Oh, that's right. <laughs> All right, let's go then. Oh, just leaves the two of us, just, just me and Yuichi, out here, you know, him half naked. Just the two of us. <clears throat> and, uh... What about you? Aren't you going with them? Oh, well, I mean, they didn't ask for my help. I mean, I, I guess I can just give them a hand when they come back, right? Hey, you don't have to do all these stupid chores if you don't want to, you know. You already did enough today by winning us the competition. You probably changed those stupid Scoutmasters' minds, too. So, yeah, I'm out of here before I get roped into something lame, you know? Where are you going, Yoichi? I'm going to the woods, if you gotta know. I got important stuff to do. Can I come with you? I don't want to do chores either. We'll get scolded by the Scoutmasters. We have to help clean. Okay, well, again, I think... Each of these probably relates in some manner to each of the four other cabin mates. We have to help clean is probably Natsumi. That sounds like something Natsumi. Well, no. Maybe we'll get scolded by the Scoutmasters. That's probably Natsumi, right? We have to help clean. That might be Hunter. I don't want to do chores either. So which one is Yoichi? Can I come with you, or I don't want to do chores either? Hmm. I think we're just gonna we're gonna mirror his behavior. Can I come with you? I want to come with him, but again, I think that might be like too sentimental for Yoichi. I don't know. That's that's not really how he works. I think if we just mirror his behavior, maybe that's the ticket. I want to go with this one. But I don't want to do chores either. Can I come with you instead? Ha! <laughs> now you're speaking my language. Ah, I, th I think I think we made the right choice. Eh, you're not so bad, you know. But it might not be a good idea for you to come with me, Katero. You don't know how dangerous it can be in there, all right? Trust me. But I'll have you to protect me, right, Yoichi? Off to the woods again, Yoichi? Hey, 
That's none of your business, Scoutmaster. Ah, uh, Scoutmaster Yoshi. We, we, we were just, uh, you know, we weren't doing anything. We were just... No need to explain, Katero. I know exactly what's going on. Do you? Do you really? <laughs> Do you really know exactly what's going on? You might. Convince me, though. You may go, Yoichi. Just don't wander off too far, all right? Yeah, whatever, Sheriff broke back. Ho, 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 man, Yoichi. Whew. Sh Sheriff broke back? Quite a catchy nickname, isn't it? I don't really know what it means, but I like it. <laughs> Yoshi would. <laughs> Only Yoshinori would not understand it, but be like, yeah, that's kind of cool. I like that nickname. Uh, yeah, I, I see. Um, does it have any particular meaning, Katero? Um, you know, it's, 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 it's probably not, it's not really important, Scoutmaster Yoshi, it, it, you know, don't lose any sleep over it. I wonder why Scoutmaster Yoshi is so lenient with Yuichi, letting him call him names and skip chores like that? Scoutmaster Yoshi, do you know why Yoichi would want to go into the woods? Ah. You're worried about your friend, aren't you? I'm sure you know by now that Yoichi is quite hard to control, but really, he doesn't mean any harm. He's always liked having his alone time in the woods. He'll be back in an hour or so. There's no need for you to worry. I see. Anyway, great job with today's activity, Gatoro. Your plan has worked wonders for us. I really owe you one for this. Of course, Scoutmaster Yoshi. I'm just glad I was able to help you out. Oh, and you have my permission to skip today's cleanup duty if you want. You can consider it a little thank you for everything that you've done today. But don't tell the other scouts, all right? <laughs> ah, uh, Scoutmaster Yoshi, uh... Thank you. Yoshi, I thought I told you to leave the supervision to me and Aiden. Ah. Uh, what kind of Scoutmaster can't follow the simplest order? Ow, 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 Yuri, that's my good ear. His good ear? Does he have a bad ear? Hmm. Well, now what should I do? Are you kidding me, Katero? Follow Yoichi. Scoutmaster Yoshi didn't really say why Yuichi wanted to go into the woods. Maybe I should go follow him. You should absolutely go follow him. Hmm, let's see. Uh, maybe Yoichi went this way. You're just guessing? You're guessing? Come on. Oh, there's Yuki. <laughs> that sound. Yuki! What? <laughs> What are you doing out here? Why are you off your leash? <laughs> oh, you're so cute. You deserve a belly rub. <laughs> I guess you were just surprised by me the first time I saw you, huh? You're actually really nice. Just like someone else I know. Hmm. You must be hungry. But uh, I don't have any food, Yuki. Well, this is the first time I've seen Yuki be this friendly with someone. Yoichi. What are you doing here? Didn't I tell you not to follow me? W well, I was just curious to find out where you went, Yoichi. Hey, curiosity killed the cat, you know. It's a good thing Yuki here isn't mean to you. She likes to hunt, so I always set her loose before feeding her. Oh, so that's why she's off her leash? 
Yuki, I scatter your food around the woods. You can hunt for it now, all right? Go. Burp. I guess you really are as hard-headed as I am. If you keep sticking around me, people will think you're a delinquent too, you know. I don't think you're a delinquent, Yuichi. Oh, come on. Everyone thinks I'm good for nothing but trouble here at camp. Well, not like I care anyway, huh. But I'm telling the truth, Yoichi. Knowing that you weren't trying to avoid chores and, and just wanted to come feed Yuki was... was really sweet of you. Shut up. You're making me barf. Maybe you do have a soft spot after all, Yuichi. Hey! What the hell are you so mushy for all of a sudden, huh? Are you trying to hit on me? What? <laughs> I'm just... Hey, it's obvious just by looking at your face, you know. You're as red as a tomato. Don't you think I've noticed how much you've been staring at my bod since the start of the sports fest? I know you want something from me. That's why you followed me all the way here. Isn't that right? Did he see me? Did he see me in the shower? Yoichi, how did you... Oh, come on. You really think I couldn't smell on you after you snuck out of the bathroom the other day? You're really not good at keeping secrets like that, you know. Ah. Plus, you were really taking your time back then. Do you even know how to f***? <sighs> Yoichi... <laughs> you should see how much you're blushing right now. Since nobody's around, why don't I give you a little lesson? Besides, don't think that I forgot that you still owe me a, uh, a treat for winning my race. Before I knew it, Yoichi had grabbed me by my arm and pulled down his pants to reveal his... I won't. I won't forget any of it. It's burned into my memory. Yoichi, we we really made a mess. What? He's not gonna give Katero the common decency of a... Uh... Oh, man. Yoichi, you're a selfish bastard. Uh, maybe we should go to the bathroom. <laughs> you ready for another round, huh? Um, I haven't had my first round, buddy. Uh, no, th that, that's not what I meant. I mean, to clean up all of this, um, you know. <laughs> that's so lame. I can always just wipe it off on my scoff. See? All clean. Yoichi, it's still dripping from your scarf. <sighs> Come on. Give me that. I can clean it for you. Ugh. Fine. I don't get what everyone's deal is with cleaning up. Well, it's not bad to clean up a little, Yoichi. Eh, whatever. Okay, I'll go back to the cabin and wash this, and, and I'll take a shower as well. You want to come with me? Me? Taking a shower? <laughs> No freaking way! Ah. Uh, okay, well, you, you're just gonna... Alright, you know, I'll just, I'll just go, I'll go back to the shower by myself and just, um, you know, I'll just take care of business. Oh, and, uh, Yuichi, you're a selfish bastard. What? Ah, uh, thanks for the lesson. I'll make sure to keep it in mind. He knows. Look at him. He knows. That idiot. <sighs> well, I guess it wouldn't hurt to take a bath, too. Unfortunately, playtime is over for today. We'll see you next time, right back here in the sandbox.